So this is part three of Digital Marketing for Beginners. And in this episode, we're going to talk about planning a digital marketing campaign for your brand or your business. Let's do this. Although digital marketing is very profitable as a venture for anyone, it needs to be implemented properly. I don't care if you've used all those seven strategies which we talked about in the previous two parts for digital marketing for beginners. This is very important as well. Otherwise, you won't see the results that you want. Devising and implementing a strategy that would yield results is not easy. It's easier said than done, of course. It involves lots, a lot, a lot of strategy developing those strategies, researching, and being creative all at the same time. And I'm going to list down two things that can help you to help start your digital marketing planning. Very quickly, just with number one, is you want to identify your target audience. Like what we say in marketing, if you're targeting everyone, you're not targeting anyone. You shouldn't sell a product for everyone because it won't make sense. An effective digital marketing strategy begins with setting your goals and target Targeting the right audience. And you won't generate any sort of lead, even if you wanted to, for your email marketing campaign, if you're targeting an audience that has absolutely no interest in your products or your services. Imagine selling a swimsuit to someone that does rock climbing. It does not make sense to them. With all the, the continuous development in the digital marketing industry today, targeting the right audience is easier than ever so that you're not confused into selling parts for a motorcycle for for someone that's into cars or vice versa. Digital marketing agencies specialize in targeting the right audience for businesses and could help you in this area. And that's why we have our advertising agency, Aguirre Advertising, just for that. Let me know. Number two, develop a marketing funnel to achieve your goal. What's a marketing funnel? A marketing funnel refers to the steps that you take to convert a prospect into an actual customer. It's the customer's journey from the first time that they search you on the internet through buying your product or your service and converting them to be an actual buyer. Different levels in the funnel will require different digital marketing tactics or strategies. In the beginning, the customer is searching for answers to their questions or solutions to the problems that they have. Every time you buy a product, it solves a certain problem that you have. Like every tool that you buy on online shopping, for example, for your kitchen, solves a certain problem. That's how it works. And a well-optimized blog article provides answers that can be found when they submit their query to a search engine. For example, you're looking for a jacket and you're looking to go to a country where a jacket is a necessity because it's really cold. So now you'll be searching for top types of jackets for certain types of weather. If it's good for this, for that, and up to what kind of weather it can help you withstand. If you're you're just going to a country where in it's just below 10 degrees, negative 5, for example. So there's different jackets for that. And when you do a right funnel for that, you will target your right audience based on the product that you're trying to sell them. At another stage, if the customer is researching different vendors and comparing solutions, they want detailed information that compares the features and the benefits that it has for them. Or maybe they need more information on how to implement the product that they have. Or maybe they need more information how to implement the product. For example, an ebook. That's why a lot of people are giving out free ebooks. It makes it easy for people to share information with their decision making unit. Most of the times that I buy a new product, when someone sells me, for example, a certain service, I always get a free ebook that they give out if you sign up for their mailing service. And I read those ebooks. It gives me more information of what I can get when I subscribe to their product or, or service that they offer offer and it helps a lot with my decision making. At all points after the initial brand contact with you, remarketing ads can be used to remind them of the brand and bring them back to the website. For example, there's this service that I bought online from a seller and it took about eight emails from that person and about two ebooks that they sent out for free for being a subscriber before I actually bought into their product which actually cost $99. He only sent me a couple of emails. I probably wouldn't have bought their product 
stuck during that time. But because, you know, they're consistent about it, they're doing it almost every week or every week perhaps, it gave me more ideas of how the product can actually help me in the long run. Understand your target audience and their purchasing behaviors. It's an essential part into building an effective funnel that converts perspective customers into actually buying customers. A digital marketing agency like Gear Advertising can help you build your sales funnels to get the best results. And we have a team of people that can actually help you in terms of your goals into reaching your right target market. So that's it for digital marketing for beginners. Now, digital marketing is really essential if you want your business to survive and thrive in this current century that we're in right now. It can be an effective way Way to convert customers to your brand without spending a lot on ad money and resources if you know how to do these certain techniques. But of course, to be successful, you need to understand what you're doing by setting clear goals, choosing the right channels, and measuring the results that you have. So that's why when you put in money into doing ads and it works, if you do put in more money, it will generate more income for your business. And on top of that, if you throw in a healthy dose of creativity, that would be very helpful as well. That's why hiring a lot of people who are creative in these fields are very helpful for your business. It's a very, very good investment. So if you want to increase your bottom line but don't have the time to do it yourself, a digital marketing agency can help. A digital marketing agency is staffed by professionals or people with a lot of experience or years of experience in creating content, optimizing websites for search, building paid advertising campaigns, and even analyzing metrics so that you have data to measure for your business. Because I believe more in data rather than just emotions. Like I think that a lot of people are buying. Like how many? It should be quantifiable and you can measure it. So our team over at Agir Advertising can help you get started out in digital marketing or help you assess your existing digital campaigns. Now, if you want to contact us for a free consultation, you can send us an email at info at antonioaguirrejr.com or send us a text message 0998-994-1104. And I'll see you again in the next episode.